Hey students, just wanted to touch base and give you the three big things that we're taking care of today. I know, I know, you're kind of surprised to see me since, you know, with the whole coronavirus thing and I went to the store and didn't get any meat the other day. My wife's winning on the cheetah diet. So I think I'll be okay. I think I'll make it to the end of the school year here, or at least till we see each other again. Um, but if anybody knows of any good spots to get some meat, let me know because I'm starting to weather away a little bit. But anyway, let's get moving forward here a little bit. Um, we are going to do t three things today. Our first thing for this week's assignment is to learn and understand what we're going to do for our meetings. Our second thing that we're going to do is create a folder in our architecture folder in Google Drive to store all this stuff. So we still got our G Drive, you still got your architecture folder and all your information, but we're going to try to get the information back out of here. We're going to clean this up a little bit too today. Our third thing is to make sure you can get into SketchUp for schools. And we're going to be designing in SketchUp now. Um, so we'll be able to use your Chromebook if you want to. You can use a computer at home if you want to. Whatever makes the most sense for you to create stuff with. So we're still going to have fun building CAD models. Still going to work in the architecture world. And um, luckily we did a little bit of planning for this. So here we go. Step number one. Talking about Google Meet. Um, I've set you guys up. I've created a meeting schedule for us um, in Google Meet, and I created a calendar, a Google Calendar. Let me kind of slide to that first week there. And in that Google, Google Calendar, every day you have a setup of when your, your group can meet or when your class can meet. They've set those times up. And for first hour, it's 9 to 9.30, and then second hour, of course, I have 9.30 to 10 o'clock. So you have half an hour meeting times throughout the day there. Um, I invited everybody to, a, to this meeting. So you're going to have the Hangouts meet here. So if you go to your calendar, which means calendar.google.com, and it'll bring you up to your calendar. And you can go to the day. And that day will be the 31st, will be our first meeting. And you can click on here and you can get to your Hangouts Meet. You can also join by putting this pin in. It looks, I'm going to be honest, I haven't used this a whole ton. Um, but it looks like the pin stays the same here. But you can always come to your calendar and find it, or I'm going to put this pin in our Schoology course as well. So tomorrow, or Tuesday the 31st, we're going to have our first meeting where we're all in it. I put all of you guys in, both CAD 1 and CAD 2, and we're just going to have a chat and see how things are going and go from there. It's going to be a pretty easy first week. You can ask questions then as well about what's happening. Um, so we get our questions answered on Tuesday. Wednesday you have to work and fix those questions. Thursday you have your time to ask questions again if you can't get something figured out. And then Friday everything will be due. So Monday it will be assigned. Tuesday ask questions. Wednesday fix questions. Thursday um, ask questions again. And Friday will be assigning. So going back on this, we got that kind of taken care of. We kind of know how to get there. Um, you're just going to, if you go to your calendar, you can go to join Hangouts Meet. Getting ready. Camera is starting. This little button is your microphone. This little button is your camera. Um, when you're not talking, I'll have you turn your microphone off just so we don't get a whole bunch of information. My camera just failed because I'm already using it. But then you're going to hit join. 
and on join now. Now the meeting started, we'll be able to see everybody that's in this meeting and we'll be able to get this figured out. So that's step one, already done, boom, simple. Step two, you're gonna go into your architecture folder. So you're gonna go into drive.google.com. I went into my drive, I got into my architecture folder. First step here, I'm gonna do a little bit of cleanup. So if it's anything 5.1-1, and then I got these two here, right click on them and I'm gonna hit remove. Right here's a second copy. Hopefully you don't have a bunch of copies here, like I do. But that's how you would clean all that stuff up. Exercise 3.2 and I got all these extra ones. I'm just holding down shift or I can hold down control and I can click on these all these extra copies. Right click once in a while and hit remove. You can go through the whole thing and do it but if you click something wrong you're going to give yourself a little bit of a headache. This one here I just use shift so I can click the bottom one. I have no idea why all of a sudden I started making 20 copies, but you can see the process going on here. You don't have to watch me clean my whole thing up. But in here, we're going to click New, we're going to go Folder, and we're going to call it SketchUp. So this is your second part of your assignment for this week. We're going to make a SketchUp folder inside our architecture folder. Boom. Done. So now I got my SketchUp folder. I have to make that inside a drive first before I do any work in here. Last thing we're dealing with is SketchUp for schools. Now, a lot of you put this app on already. It's in my apps, SketchUp for schools. Um, sometimes you're gonna have to click, like on your Chromebook, you got that little circle. It's For mine, it says talk to Cartana, but it's not Cartana for you. You get to click on that little circle and then it says SketchUp for schools. And it'll ask you to log in probably. I'm already logged in. You're going to log in with your Google account. It should say your school account here. Um, home gets you here. And then I am going to have you click on the little lock right here and drag that onto your bookmarks bar. We are going to use this so much you want to drag that onto your bookmarks bar so you're good to go. You can, if you would want to, you can also put this Hangouts, I believe is going to be the same one all the time. You can put that on your bookmarks bar as well. So you can bookmark those two pages there. We can right click and we can add a folder and you can call it CAD. And you can hit save. Oh, my folder's way over here. So I'm going to slide that to there. And I'm going to take SketchUp Schools and put it in there. And I'm going to put my meeting in there. And look at that. I got two things in there that I am good to go with. And then I can even go over here. I put it in Schoology. I can put my CAD stuff in my CAD Schoology page in there. So it makes it easier for you. Whatever you need to do there that's going to help you out, kind of get you organized. Um, biggest thing here is trying to keep you organized and getting this stuff set up. So, you got those three things to take care of. Number one, you're going to go to Google Meeting and see if you can set up and get into that meeting. Number two, you got the meeting going here. You're going to hit Join Now just to make sure it works. Number three, or sorry, really number two, that's all one part. Number two, you're going to go into Google Drive. You're going to make your architecture folder and you're going to make your SketchUp folder inside your architecture folder and clean up all your other junk in here. Try to get that cleaned up. Last but not least, you are going to go into your my dot, or SketchUp for Schools you are going to go, your apps, you might have it. 
You might have it down here in your little button you click on and then it says SketchUp for Schools. Bookmark that, get that all set up. Three things to take care of, meeting, Google Drive, and bookmarks. If you have any questions, no big deal. Tomorrow, we're gonna set up this meeting and we're gonna show up and we're gonna all get here on this meeting. You can ask your questions tomorrow. All right, good luck.